I was born. Something in the way he sounds might remind you of someone. I just knew this had to be it's my life, it's my love and my home. His face might be familiar too. This is John Lennon's father, Alfred, or to his would-be fans, Freddie Lennon. But this, his only song, was released 60 years ago and then forgotten. Record producer John reckons it deserves a second chance. That was the first thing that hit me. Wow, that's definitely John Lennon's dad. They sound the same. You know, intonations there. It's, it's like, whoa, this is spooky. This is where John got his talent from, his old man. So that's the father, here comes the son. It was when Beatlemania was at its most manic that Freddie released his song. He'd been away in the Merchant Navy for most of John's childhood. When he returned, his son had become one of the four most famous faces on earth. And a producer signed up Freddie, hoping that name would sell records by itself. So why have you never heard of this record? Well, listen to this. A week after Freddie Lennon's record was released, it was mysteriously pulled, deleted from all record stores. No one quite found out why, but the producers had their suspicions. The rumour was that as John recorded with the Beatles, he thought his dad was trying to cash in. Today's Beatle maniacs were a bit kinder. What do you think? It sounds very Beatles-esque. Do you yes. think? Yes. Yeah. I think same, it's, I think same voice. Gray, Gray, like Mike, of course. My goodness. Does it remind you of anyone? Yeah, it brings some memories. Perhaps a dream maker. Alfred Lennon died in 1975, five years before John. He never did sell many singles, but there's no denying Freddie changed the path of pop history for good. Dominic Reynolds, 5 News.